Ever since Kanye West and Bianca Sensora got together, their romance has been at the center of controversy, specifically when it comes to her outfits. For a while now, Sensora has made headlines for her controversial revealing outfits, with conflicting insiders claiming she's all for these outfits and others claiming it's all West's idea. Along with that, sources claim that Kim Kardashian isn't the biggest fan of Sensori's ensembles, especially when she's near her and West's kids. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West's kids' feelings on Bianca Sensori's daring outfits shows how they're ahead of the curve. However, insiders also just told In Touch Weekly that West and Kardashian's four children actually don't mind Sensori's outfits at all. The kids think Bianca is cool, but some of her outfits are eyebrow razors, the insider said to the outlet. They giggle about some of the more revealing things she wears, but they do like her. So while they may not understand the outfits and do seemingly like sensory and are of the mindset of, if she likes them, then why not? Whether or not she's up to dressing like this is a whole other discussion, because we're talking about how we love that Kardashian and West's kids are so chill with whatever people wear. They're not judgmental or mean about it. They like sensory and want her to be happy. We truly love to see that mindset, especially with the younger generations. For those who don't know, West and Sensori started dating in Nov 2022 and allegedly tied the knot two months later. The reason the legality behind this union is up in the air is that while they did have a secret ceremony, no marriage certificate or license has been found for the New York Post. Wes and his ex-wife Kim Kardashian share four children together, of whom Sensori is the stepmother of. Their names are North, born in June 2013, Saint, born in Deck 2015, Chicago, born in Jan 2018, and Song, born in May 2019. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West have always seemed to have a complex relationship. The rapper and the reality star sparked fans' interest when they began dating and later welcomed their first child together, Northwest. The duo eventually tied the knot and went on to have three more children, Saint, Chicago, and Song. However, they couldn't make things work and they officially called it quits in early 2021. Sadly, the drama between them only got worse after they decided to end their marriage. Online outbursts, shocking claims, and wild rumors took over the narrative. Now, three years later, the pair are still allegedly having issues. Sources claim that despite their divorce, Wes can't seem to let go of Kardashian. Although the rapper is currently remarried to Bianca Sensory, he still has a huge hold over his ex-wife's life. Heat World reports that Wes has been a huge reason why Kardashian can't seem to find love again following their split. Although she's had public romances with comedian Pete Davidson and NFL star Odell Beckham Jr., it hasn't worked out. Recently, Kim Kardashian and Odell Beckham Jr. split and Kanye West's influence may have been to blame. Odell has been open about how he's completely turned off by the Kanye factor, the insider said. Getting serious with Kim would mean coming into Kanye's world being in the firing line for all his social media rants, getting dragged into face-to-face -face meetings, and having to endure him during custody drop-offs. What's more, the way Kanye harassed and humiliated Pete Davidson really hit home for him. Even though they're not longer married, West and Kardashian are forever linked through their four children. The rapper reportedly knows that his former wife will never be able to get rid of him and he's allegedly finding delight in her failed relationships. Kanye has said from day one that Kim will never find anyone as good as him, and he stands by that, the informant dished. He's definitely getting a huge kick out of the fact that she's been unable to move on. While he's got Bianca by his side, his whole mindset with Kim is that if he can't have her, no one else can. It seems like he'll never let her be happy. It remains to be seen what the future holds for Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. However, fans hope that they can move past any toxic issues they may have. Justin Bieber and the Kardashian-Jenner family have been linked for several years. They have been photographed hanging out numerous times, the ladies are close friends with Justin's wife Hailey Bieber and Khloe Kardashian even lived in Justin's former house. There have also been rumors that Justin has dated not one, not two, not three, but the four Kardashian-Jenner sisters, Kendall, Kelly, Courtney, and Kim. This time, we're doing a deep dive on one sister in particular, Kim, and whether she's ever been called baby by the crooner. The bieber Kardashian jenner connection started with Kim. When Kim was 29 and Justin was 16, they posed together in a photo shoot for Elle. Some of the images were suggestive, such as the pair running on the beach, holding hands in wet clothes. This inappropriate age gap between Justin and Kim met the pair with controversy. At the time, TV host Bill O'Reilly said, I'll tell you this. If a girl was pictured with a man in any of that, he'd be in big trouble. Game over. When images from the photo shoot resurfaced more recently, people were also appalled that the photo shoot was allowed to happen. As a kid, I was so jealous when I saw these pictures, but as an adult, user wrote on this thread, not so cringe and low-key inappropriate. It's high-key inappropriate, another responded. Justin is and looks like a baby is disturbing. If genders were reversed, this would have never been printed. 
After the photo shoot, Justin posted one of the images on X and jokingly referred to Kim as his girlfriend. Some fans didn't take kindly to the joke and began sending the reality star death threats. This prompted Justin to take action and clarify their relationship status. But not thus sending a flirty comment Kim's way, ladies calm down. Kim Kardashian is a friend, he wrote on X, a very sexy friend, but a friend. No need for threats. Let's all be friends and hang out often.